Hi, this is War Nerf Mods, and I'm just gonna make a quick arsenal video. So, yeah, this I basically just have them all lined up on the wall. I don't really have a ton, but that's because I'm sort of new. But over here, I have shells and parts that can be reused. So, yeah, use those for some stuff. Just cosmetic work. Um, in here I have like most of my barrels, um, springs, glues, just a lot of materials. Some tools, not really. I have all my tools somewhere else. But then here I have clips that I'm not using and darts. Yeah, so some Stefan's. But, yeah, I mostly just keep darts in blasters except clips. don't really want to keep streamlines in clips for a long time. It kind of bends them out of shape like that or leaves like these lines on the top from the clips. So then I also just finished this. This isn't for me. This is for a friend for his birthday. But, yeah, it's just a marshmallow um, bow or like the bow and mallow or something, PVC couplered. It looks like it's just taped on, but it's not. That's just for extra stability. Then uh, CPVC speed loader with PVC just stuck on it. So yeah, that's new. Um, yeah, I'll just go through. This is my Gear Up Raider, which um, will as soon as I get it, be getting uh, Orange Mod Works kit, which I was actually one of the winners for their contest. It's not on this um, account; it's on one of my other accounts. This is my Nerf account, but they're just a few Stephens I made. And then my 211, which if you haven't seen the video for that, you can go do that. I did put foam on the back. This isn't usually on there. I just have that on there for extra padding. So yeah, I also made a new barrel for it because the other one was kind of crooked. And it actually has a 100% seal now. And I figured out a good way to test seals. You get like your ball valve. And then you get a short piece of PVC to get it off. And put it in there. Make sure it's closed, and then you just stick that on the front. So, yeah, let me cram it real quick. Oh, you gotta open it to pull it back, because this has a good seal, so it can't pull back if this is closed. So yeah, I just, instead of just um, screwing the coupler and stuff in here, I gooped it all in. So it gets a way better, better seal and if you're making one of these I would definitely suggest doing that because before it just had a horrible seal and yeah so yeah it just stops and I can open the valve so yeah that's perfect seal um, next I don't think I've made a video on this because it's kind of pretty crappy except for the Maverick the Maverick's probably the best part but it's just a singled recon, which I would not recommend doing. Yeah, it's kind of, I need to fix some stuff on it. It probably got better ranges with uh, just a clip system than singled, so don't do that to your recon. It's not good for it. And it has a pretty good power stock on the back. I can get it off. Um, okay, can't get it off. Don't know why. Then just has detachable um, barrel with Maverick integration. Then my long shot. Oh, this stuff's going over. Which I have a video on. Yep, just a uh, normal. I want to get like Angel Breach or something for it. That'd be way better. Get better ages. Just front gun integration. All the basic long shot stuff. Then just have some belts, the bandolier thing. And then my Vulcan, 
which just has voltage mod and it's minimized. It also has a paint job. Bring it over here. There's a video on that. I have videos on most of this stuff. Then stock speed load six, stock practices, um, AirTech 3000. Just video on that. It's probably my second best. I would use it as a primary. My first best is definitely my 211. But it's my best, um, like, non homemade. Then stock swarm fire, which we'll probably be getting a mod because it's a lot easier than most of the other um, dart tag guns. Yeah, so all my dart tag ones are stock. I have all of them except the sharp shot. And then I have this, uh, which is just the crappy Titan pistol. It actually works really well, so it's not really crappy. But I haven't made a video on this. It's just like a steampunk maverick. It's, yeah, it, it works really well. It was actually my first mod I ever did. So I used that, like, for a pistol. Just doing pistol stuff. And this one is a work in progress. But I will show it to you. It's a barrel break with a vendetta sword on the front and a fury fire um, turret, I think. So right now, I had the idea to get a, like a really good seal, to put all these little CPVC nubs, and then put two halves of a coupler on it. And sometimes it fits in really good, but then when they don't line up just right, yeah, you pull it out and stick it back on. You can see that some have fallen off, because if you don't line it up just right, then, or these things, if they don't like line up on both sides, um, one of them will like break off. So. I'll probably just end up making like some kind of seal out of rubber washers or something. But then it just has two pullback. Um, yeah. I'll just dry fire it because it's not really going to be used in anything. So, yeah, you can put. I was going to. Well, sometime I want to put two Nightfinder um, priming bar like handles, I guess, on the back. It could just stick those in the CPPC. And yeah, that's basically it. Um, I have some a little bit more stuff, but it's just not up here. Um, yeah, so all my parts, some stock stuff. Here's just some random tubing. But yep. Oh, and I also figured out how to make a uh, like kind of streamline, I guess and which it's flat on the front and it works in clip systems but all you do it's really easy i've never really seen anybody do this but you just take a whistler and it's kind of hard to do this with one hand but you just kind of peel that up and usually let's see if i can get it in the camera mm. yep, you just peel the orange part off got a dart that works in clips. That's a lot more accurate. And yeah, it works way better than you're just left with this piece. So, figure out something to do with that. Yeah, that's it. And I'm also, if, I'm don't, not a lot of people watch my channel, but if you're going to the Minnesota March Tacular War, you'll see me there. I'm going. So yeah, that's going to be really fun. It's going to be my first war ever. Whoa. Yeah. Well, like first like official war that's not just with friends or something. So I'm planning on bringing most of my stuff. Um, and I'll trade some or buy some stuff. And I'm buying a bunch of um, red MHA pink foam slugs there. I'm going to buy 500 of them. There's a guy selling them. So me and my dad are going to be there. And I'll probably just lend him something, probably my uh, 3K. But yeah, so thanks for watching.